I for one, Boris, I agree with you, my man. Locked us all down, given us a set of rules because British people act like children. You have to be told to stay in. You have to be told how many times you can go out a day. But he's alright though, because I agree with it totally. And then you've got some people now saying, but it's not a full lockdown. What do you want? Shut up! He's staggering the process. The main aim is to lock us down anyway. He just wanted to do it gradually. Like, we asked for it and now we have it. And I bet you were still gonna complain. Loads of people are like, oh, he's not doing enough. We need to take action. He's done everything we've asked and yet we're still complaining. A lot of people don't understand, you know, a lot of this is on us. We have to take note, we have to take action. It shouldn't be the fact that you've got grown adults having to be forced to stay in their houses. What the fuck is wrong with you people? And I know I'm saying this while I'm outside cycling, but I'm cycling to work. I'm one of the ones that still has to work. I'm not saving lives. I just work. I just work. So I get two forms of exercise a day, to and from work. And then I get another one session if I want to get it in. So it's win-win for me. You know what else I can't understand? I've never seen so many people exercising. It takes a fucking worldwide pandemic for you all to start getting your fucking Nike on and get out and enjoy the fucking world. Start jogging. Well, well, I, I, I don't understand it. <laughs> when people tell you you can't do something, you want to do it. Madness. Yeah, look. She's one of them birds that's surviving this pandemic, I'll tell you that much. Fuck you now. And listen, I'm only going to work because I have to. I've got a family to provide for. Well, we'll get to that bit. But the moment I'm told, James, you can stay at home, get the 80% pay, I'm doing that. And I leave in my house. Listen, there are so many things you could do in your house. I'm reading on Facebook, people saying, it's a conspiracy, man. The government ain't gonna stop me doing my thing. What thing? I think you'll find, my brother, that if everyone's locked up, everything's closed, there is nothing to be done. Stay your ass in your house. Relax. Think of this as some you time. Get your mind right. Practice yoga. Fucking start knitting. London is on lockdown and I for one, I'm enjoying it and we're only in the first morning. I can't wait to see what this afternoon brings. Around here, this is only archway. Something else, yeah. <laughs> All you panic buyers that were out there panic buying everything, queuing up, your dicks, because you're the ones that are spreading the shit. Standing like two foot away for Kieran and Cam. It ain't good. You're the ones, you're the problem. They need reporting because they're selling fucking toilet roll for £10 a pop. Right here in this FedEx van, just cut me up. Look, cut me straight up. Cut me up. I hate FedEx. I'm not moaning about having a job because I know there's a lot of unfortunate people out there that have been laid off. And I feel for you, I really do, because your companies are pieces of shit. Because at times like these, you know how a company values their employees and how they look after them. I'm, I'm lucky enough to have a company that's looking after me 
and wine so listen just embrace it man like the sooner we all listen to this the sooner we'll all be back to normal and then it's party time surviving this the crackheads they're gonna survive this crackheads always survive shit and it's not like they just locked us in and said we can't do nothing we're allowed to go shopping once exercise once doctors medical needs come on man they're doing us a favor do them a favor stay your asses in your houses yeah London's on lockdown and the sooner we can adhi adhere to the rules, get this shit over and done with, the sooner we can get back to normality. So if I was all of you, I'd stay your asses in your houses. Don't get up, don't get out, don't go get it. Get a hobby, play with your kids, do your garden. Start a YouTube channel, do something. Just stay in your houses for three to four weeks minimum. Anyway, I'll catch you next time. Take it easy. Peace. Uh, 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 uh.